The past two weeks we've been talking about players coming into Hearts, coming into Edinburgh, but unfortunately now we have a player going the opposite direction. Welcome back guys to Son of Scotland TV. And Lewis Nielsen has completed a move away from Hearts. That is the bad news. The good news is it's only a loan deal. Yes, he will be joining Partick Thistle on loan until the end of the 2023-2024 campaign. The 20-year-old centre-back heads to Maryhill to get first-team experience in Chris Doolan's side, having made 16 appearances for the Jambos last season. And importantly, we have a recall option in January. So that is the basics. It's going to be a year-long loan with the possibility of us bringing him back in January. How do I feel about this? You know what? I like Lewis Nielsen. I can see a lot of potential in him and I think he has what it takes to be a starting player at Hearts. I can see him being one of our start starting centre-backs. I see a lot of John Suter in Lewis Nielsen now. Is he good enough right now to be starting for Hearts? Possibly not. You know, we've got players that are ahead of him. There's no doubt about this. There's so many players we've got that we can play at centre-back. We've got Rolls, got Halkett, Civic at times last season looked really good. Uh, you've got Kingsley who can play centre back. We've got some of the new signings, Kent, who can play there as well. So, I mean, if we're being honest, Lewis Nielsen probably, as things stand, might find himself, what, maybe fifth, sixth in the pecking order at best. So it does make sense for him if he wants to leave, if he wants to get first team football, it makes sense for him to go on loan. I would have liked him to stay, but I've got to look at the devil's advocate. If he stays, the majority of his time here this season is going to be on the bench. He's not going to be featuring. Whereas, if he goes to Partick Thistle, he should be a starter. He should get first-team football at Partick Thistle. And I also think it's a good move for him. Partick Thistle, in my opinion, should be playing in the Premiership this season. They bottled it last season. They've got a decent team. I know they've lost a couple of key players. But I think getting Nielsen in will help Partick Fischl push. And I expect them to be challenging for the Scottish Championship. And I think Lewis Nielsen can be a big reason why they do it. So I think it's a good move for all parties. It's a good move for Hearts. It's a good move for Nielsen. It's a good move for Partick Fischl. I'm just glad that it's a loan move and not permanent. Because like I said, I think Lewis Nielsen has a lot of potential, and I'm, I, I am really excited to see how he gets on. So, no, nah, man, it is, it is a good move. I, I'll accept this, and maybe we should just let him stay for the whole year. Now, of course, if we do get injuries, if we are a little bit light come January, then recalling him might be an option, but I would let him stay there for the year and see how he gets on. That's pretty much it, guys. We've got the football season starting in two days. Cannot wait for the opening game. I've still to do my predictions. I'm going to probably do that tomorrow. Still haven't decided who I'm predicting to finish where. The only prediction I've really made is I've got one spot where I know who I'm putting a team. Other than that, I'm not entirely sure. So I'm going to take another like, day, another 24 hours to think about it. I know all the kits are out now, the home kits and away kits. I might do a video ranking my favourite kits. And um, yeah, that, that's pretty much it, guys. Then we will have the start of the season and I, I cannot wait. Fucking cannot wait. Absolutely buzzing to get this new season underway, man. Looking forward to watching all the action on Saturday. Anyway, guys, that's it. We'll catch you in the next one. Until then, been on Scotland TV. Good luck, Lewis Nielsen at Partick Thistle. And hopefully you can win yourselves a Scottish Championship medal. Till then, though, peace.